Good morning, my friends, and welcome back where we're going to share another shave today brought to us by Barrister Man's Vespers. We're entering into the Christmas season, and uh, I've had this soap for a while, and if I don't use it, I'm never going to get it done. I mean, it's never going to get used up. It smells wonderful. I've got it already uh, lathered for us here. I'm using a Omega uh, bat, uh, Bore Brush. True to Berkshire Man's uh, history, this is a great soap as far as lather goes. Lather's pretty easy. Doesn't take a huge amount of water to get a pretty nice lather. I'm not even sure if the soap is still in production, but it's really nice. Having a, a handbell concert later this evening. And uh, I have to be pretty, so I figured I'd go ahead and shave with a seasonal soap, kind of get me in the mood. Uh, today's razor is Rockwell uh, T2, uh, set on four. Uh, this is with a, I don't know what, uh, let's see what it is. I can get it open. Oh, I don't know why I even looked. It's a Wizabet uh, blade. One thing I really like about these, uh, the T-type is how, once you get it in, how firmly it locks the blade in place. So it, it does a pretty good job. It feels very solid. It's a heavy razor too, by the way. Good things. Really taken right down. And even take this little corner of my mustache, which I choose to not have grown out. If I'd thought about it, I'd have looked up the scent notes so that I could tell you what the scent notes of this so far, but I didn't, so I can't, so I won't. But I can tell you this razor is doing a wonderful job. I reviewed this razor a number of times and I continue to enjoy it. It seems to be one that you guys are looking for feedback on. Uh, I can tell you that I've enjoyed this one while well, I've had it, but I've got so many razors that I have to kind of rotate around so it doesn't get as much play time as it probably should. So, I just have to enjoy it when I do bring it out and kind of make over it and stuff because I do like the razor. I have a few still that I haven't, haven't used at all yet. I suppose I ought to get busy and get ready to re review those too. But. Mixing with the water on my face this this time, lather's a little soupier than before. And it shows off my CPAP marks there. <laughs> I thought you could pretty much tell this is a morning shave. can't tell you that this is, I don't know, about five or six 
shaves on this blade. I used to take one blade and move it from razor to razor, but I got lazy and so now if I pick up a razor in my drawer, 99% of the time it's got a blade in it and I have to guess how many shaves are on there. It's kind of a bad habit I've gotten into, but I've got the habit. You guys just missed out on Safety Cat being in here. I actually have two Safety Cats. There were three once upon a time, but the founding Safety Cat, who invented the trick, uh, passed away some years ago. And his fellow cats in the house, he learned the trick. That is, they all decided that they like the smell of my shaving products and they come in when, when I'm setting things up they can hear me stropping the razor they can hear me whooping around the uh, lather bowl they come in and either hang out and just walking around or get up in the window Buster the largest one no longer fits in the sink over here so he, most of the time he's down while he's over there um, just kind of sits and watches. Noel, the smallest one. Oh, that was by the by, uh, that was Thayer's Lemon. Smallest one, she likes the window seat, but being this winter time, Vesper's aftershave. Being as it's winter, I don't have the window open very much. Mm, I just like the way it smells. I'll put it on other spots, you know, so that I smell pretty the rest of the day. And that's pretty much it. Well, let's set it in with a little bit of powder. Why not? Wife Unit is not a fan of my using talc very much. It gets all over everything. She says, you, you used talc again today, didn't you? And I said, well, yes, I did. It gets all over everything, you know. Yeah, I'm sorry. But that's it for today. I'm Major Rich, and you'll find me at theshavingcounter.com. Uh, if you're finding me on the YouTubes, and you're just kind of floating in and around, Appreciate you coming in to visit me, and I uh, hope to see you next time. And you know, basically anywhere. I'm glad to share this share this hobby with you. We will see you next time. Bye bye.